<coughs> Hi, welcome to software testing. Today we are discussing about JMeter. Okay, in JMeter, most uh, main important thing is third group. In third group, we are having number of threads and ramp up period. Okay, today I am going to explain this ramp up period. How to configure this ramp up period? Okay, this one I will explain today. See here, I have added a third group created for Gmail account, which is using for login. Okay, in coming sessions, we will discuss how to create this HTTP request. From here, just you need to sampler. Here, you need to add HTTP. I have added HTTP request. See here, HTTP request. I have given name. Okay. So, coming to ramp up period, this ramp up period is a second word we are conferring as per the thread group. Suppose you want to write you want to run the suppose uh, you have one scenario where <coughs> you want to hit it is server with a specific request okay this one we can configure using this ramp up period the formula will be so main formula will be here I am taking thread groups as a 30 and ramp up period as a 90. So it will calculate as a 90 by 30. So equal to 3. Okay. 3 means every 3 seconds loop count is 3. It is 3. Means every 3 seconds one user that is one thread will hit the number of 3 requests on the server. Okay three request on server means means one user hits three hits on server on every three seconds okay one virtual thread user hits three times on server on every three seconds okay so here coming to here 3 into 30 3 into 30 means 90 okay one HTTP request perform 90 request to the server okay so where 3 one user will come on every three seconds where hit three hits on server so total 3 into this 30 virtual user loop count is 3 so 90 every one user total hits will become as a 90 let's see let's see how it will display let me clear this one now run see here you will see samples as a 90 see everything is is running one by one these are the number of HTTP request here you will see the threads every three seconds one user will come 6 7 1 2 3 8 1 2 3 9 1 2 3 10 so every 3 seconds one user will hit on this HTTP request where 3 hits will be on server it's taking is 30 31 32 it will go on up to 90 so you will see here so this is a label means request 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So total 450 samples will come here. See it's running 49, 40 here. It is coming some late. Why? Because it's having errors. <coughs> See 100% error means some inbox or something I have written. Some In coming session you will see how to we can manually write this HTTP request to access particular web applications instead of recording okay, let's see here 72 see it is decreasing it will decrease or increase see 7 8 so 30 users everyone hit 90 it will become if you have if you face any error here it will display it will display here if it, here it is showing what are the threat it is coming 24 25 26 we will see number of it so 1 to 4, 1 to 14, 1 to 19, 16, 17 
these are the user hit see it's a stop right there is no error saying 0 ok 90 so like this if you want to if you have any particular request you want to send to the server this is a formula actually according to this ramp up period it will handle those requests ok so 90 90 90 90 around 450 so 1 2 3 4 5 request see so like that you can use a ramp up period for particular hits how many hits you want to hit on server ok yeah thank you thank you for watching in next video we will see how to write this HTTP request manually I have written say some I am using username password authentication okay, remote login everything okay yeah thank you please subscribe for more videos